You want an Oreo? Come on. You can't be mad enough at me to refuse an Oreo. They're your favorite. I even got the double stuffed. Just like how you like it. No? Wow. The whole silent treatment thing. You're serious about it. If you expect me to apologize, I'm not going to do it. I'm not sorry for what I did. Not one bit. Babe, enough with the death glare, okay? Just tell me why you're so upset. Okay, I get it. You don't want to talk. Fine. Then listen. That jerk shouldn't have laid a hand on you. When I saw him touch you, I just... I just lost it. It was like the whole world just narrowed down to his hand gripping your shoulder. To your face. He was hurting you. I could tell. And I snapped. I didn't want to go all apeshit on him, okay? I know you were handling it. I just... You do this thing when you're scared. I doubt you even realize it. You bite your lower lip. Hard enough to draw blood. So even though you were talking a big game, once I saw you do that, I reacted. So what? You're just gonna ice me out until the end of time? Fine. More orders for me then. <laughs> Look, I I'm sorry. Not because I decked him. I'll never be sorry about that. But I'm sorry that I made you upset. That wasn't my intent. I just wanted to keep you safe. I mean, you told me what that asshole did you did to you. What a piece of shit boyfriend he was. How he hurt you. And then to see him come up to you with that stupid grin and touching like you were his? I lost it. I know you didn't ask me to. And I'm not trying to say that you needed rescuing or anything. I just... <sighs> when I saw you were scared, I wanted to help. I wanted to pull you from him and hold you until you felt safe. And that's probably what I should have done. But when he called you, when he said that word, I couldn't take the high ground. I beat the shit out of him. I own that. I do it again. In a heartbeat. He won't press charges. Because if he does, then that will bring up his past. What he did to you, no one will be sympathetic to a monster like that. I'm not saying that. Look at me. I know you're not weak. You're the strongest person I know. You take the hits and you keep going like it's nothing. You do the work in therapy and you balance work and your friends and me like it's nothing. <laughs> You're a badass. No doubt about that. But you were scared. And I reacted. Maybe it was the wrong reaction. But if you want me to beg you for forgiveness, I'm not going to do it. He deserved every single punch I threw at him. Honestly, I would have bashed his face in more if you hadn't stopped me. I know violence doesn't solve anything, but I won't deny that it felt good to give that guy some of the same pain he used to give you. He deserved it, and don't try to tell me that he didn't. Fine. Maybe that's true, 
But maybe he crossed the line first. He grabbed you. What was he even doing at that party? Who even invited him? <laughs> Let it go. You can't be serious. How are you okay with this? If anyone should want revenge, it should be you. But then I get it. Then I guess. Um, you're just a better person than me. I'm sorry. I reacted. I didn't think. Baby? Hey, don't cry. Shit. Come here. Shh. I know I screwed up. I'm sorry. I must have scared you. I, di I didn't mean to. Shh. I caught you. You're safe. He's not gonna come nowhere near you. And if he does, I'll beat his ass again next time. You have one hell of a punch, love. I would know. You decked me when we first met. It was my fault. I snuck up on you. I mean, you had headphones in. I didn't see them, and then boom. You reacted. I like it, though. Definitely a different meat cute story than most. So... Forgive me. I promise. Never again. I'll take a breath next time. But there won't be a next time. <laughs> He's coming near you. Again. He's got a death wish. I love you too. <laughs> so much. Now. You gonna need an Oreo? <laughs> I figured. Save one for me, okay? 